So I thought I'd do a short video um, to demonstrate how easy it is to culture various live foods um, in the garden just using simple containers. Containers um, will have a variety of um, creatures including um, hog water lice um, which are um, similar to the more familiar uh, wood lice that you find on uh, land. Um, there will be water fleas uh, known as Daphnia and um, uh, mosquito larvae um, as well as blood worms. Um, there is also um, some um, freshwater shrimp. Uh, catching the uh, live food is fairly simple. Just take a, a net and gently um, twirl it around in the water using a figure of eight and this should bring up quite a few um, quite a few items of live food as you can see and I will tip it into the container and you can get a better look uh, at uh, what we've caught tipping into a, just a jar of water um, should give an indication of how many um, live food items there are. So this is a typical catch mainly uh, consisting of Daphnia known as water fleas uh, but there are also some additional creatures. Um, there are hog water lice which are a little bit like um, wood lice but um, a water version, if I can get a little bit closer, you might be able to see. Nope, getting out of focus. Uh, there's also a blood worm in the middle. And if we can find it, uh, there should be a um, freshwater shrimp. Yes, the freshwater shrimp is just in the middle. It looks a little bit like a hog water lice, but um, it's a different shape and swims with a different action. Uh, the hog water lice tend to crawl, uh, but the shrimp swims freely in the water. Now I'd like to demonstrate feeding um, the fish, and that's just a matter of um, dropping the net into the water, and let's see how we get on. So, as you can see, the Daphne are eat, being eaten very hungrily by um, all the fish. And if we go down to the bottom, we might be able to see some of the um, hog water lice being eaten by a selection of fish, including the clown loaches and uh, this Indian loach. This is a little bit more detail. Um, as you can see, quite a number of um, Daphnia, and there's a hog water lice working its way down. I think it's just been eaten by an angel fish. The Indian loach is always on the lookout for morsels. It seems to be a bit sleepy today. There's another hog water lice working its way down to the bottom. It's just been eaten by a female guppy, although it might be struggling to eat it due to its size. I think it's still struggling. No, I don't think it's going to be able to eat it. Hmm, maybe it will. Yes, I think it has. I tend to feed um, live food uh, once or twice uh, every other day and in between I will be giving the fish um, flake and also grindle worms which I culture indoors. I hope you've enjoyed um, watching this video and this will encourage you to culture live food in your 
um, gardens. Um, it's very simple. Uh, it's a very healthy uh, and nutritious food uh, for your fish and I would recommend it. Thank you for watching.